He came home as frequently as he could, often changing duty with some other officers and serving 48 hours straight in order to drive from the base in New Hampshire to McKinley to be with his wife. He was a very happy guy. He was full of life and fun to be around. He was a wonderful brother. I did say to him uh, when he went on submarine duty that I said, well, what happens if you get down there and you can't come up? And he said, that's it. Yeah. So he knew what he was getting into, yeah, but he loved it. They were doing what they call diving to see how deep the subs would go. And he dove to beyond what that uh, the threshold was made to do. We found out by television, yeah, and his wife also did too. And uh, he died April the tenth, so it was a big loss for the family. And he was just a great guy, you know. And I'm sure uh, they all were, yeah.